And now, our feature presentation. Hello, everyone. Uh, I, it pretty much says it in the title. I have no idea uh, what to do this stream. I don't really feel like committing to like a long play session of anything. And I haven't streamed all week, so I might as well throw one out there so it never gets to a week without streaming. play more semen thieves i would love to i'd love to just fish but i don't feel like <clears throat> getting griefed or anything right now i don't feel like having to go into fight or flight mode i just kind of want to relax the remainder of my night and maybe i can help some of y'all relax we're gonna we're gonna just go over to full screen now uh hopefully y'all can hopefully my voice is coming in nice and clear and uh you know what let's put on some background Donkey Kong music, maybe. Yeah, some... May, maybe. We'll see how... Uh, there we go. Something to have on in the background. Just a little... <laughs> Donkey Kong Country. Welcome, everyone. Jesus. I'm sorry for neglecting chat. Uh, thank you, N Noah, uh, for subscribing with Twitch Prime. Stardew Valley. Yeah, Stardew... Ah, oh, I should have hooked up uh, Animal Crossing. I could have just fished and... I haven't uh, done the... What is it? The... The Geo shit. The Geodes. Haven't done that. Haven't visited the... Haven't gotten the coffee shop. I just kind of played a few weeks ago. Just once. Just hopped on. <clears throat> yeah, it would, it would take a bit. I mean, I don't want to fucking be off camera for however long it takes me to find the necessary cords because I don't have anything really set up right now um, to capture my Switch or anything or else I would just grind Sifu probably. I'd either... It's a good game. I'm just... Sea of Thieves has taken most of my time. Okay, Scooter. R r real mature. Real mature. Wow. Y'all... Y'all just be in here. It's hot in here. Oh. Where's my water? I don't know. What the fuck? 
I had the water here, and now it's gone. There we go. There we go. Wow, level one complete? Guys, this is incredible. There's hundreds of people here, and uh, hopefully mo you know, most of y'all will probably understand that this is going to be the most boring stream of the past month. I think I've been streaming for around 20-something days, or I just got back into it. Let's see what song it's playing. I don't even know. I just don't want to have headphones on. Perfect. You can never go wrong with Donkey Kong Country. My favorite platformer of all time. Uh, Ryan, did you get a tat? I have three. What are you uh, referring to? I got one on my back, one on my ankle, and then one right here. Uh, I also see that, hold up, hold up, wait a minute, Brother Ocean subscribed with Prime, why am I not, what, do I not, are the up, oh wait, wait a second, I know what's going on, hold up, hold up, oh, this is so embarrassing, just wait, just wait chat, just wait, um, uh, yes. Uh, yes. And now alerts should come up when y'all subscribe and follow on the big screen. On the big old fucking screen. Oh my god, that is huge. <laughs> we'll put y'all over here. Yeah, put y'all over in the corner. Yeah, those who are supporting the stream, just put, uh, have y'all over there. I don't need y'all uh, muddying up the waters, okay? Let's scroll down through chat because there's a lot to catch up with. How is Lego? Please, I need to know. Lego is doing well. In fact, before we start praying, Lego. Beautiful boy. You know, he's almost eight, so. Hey. Hold on one second, chat. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Lego. Should have covered my mouth. How rude. Like you wanna you wanna come up here and, and, and say hello to the people? Come on. Yeah, yeah, good boy. Yeah. There he is. There he is. He is a big dude. He's got a big old noggin. This is the boy. Y'all have the emote of Lego, so that's good. Look how big this man is. This is just his 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 head. And I'm not, I'm not a small man. I'm not, a, I'm not tall by any means. I'm 5'11". Six foot with shoes on. Yeah, you're sneaky. Yeah, 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 I see what you're going after. Da, 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 da. Yeah, you're good. I had to, had to play father for a minute. He's gonna get himself into some. He's gonna eat some paper or some shit. Now I'm gonna have to deal with his digestive issues. I see people saying hello to Trevor. I'm I, I'm guessing Trevor has moseyed his way on in to chat. Although he's a VIP, so he should be standing out with a diamond. Ooh. I see unsubbing is here. I am sniffing a lot. It's probably all that. Coke I'm doing. Hey Twitch, I'm doing Coke. Haha. Uh -huh. Um <laughs> That that that's the real meaning of uh of praying. Hype, we got we got more hype. We got Joe Milk who subscribed. We got Frickness who gifted five fucking subs. That was two minutes ago, and I was slow to the draw to uh, say anything, but thank you. Um, whenever you subscribe or choose to use a Twitch, your, uh, Twitch Prime subscription, um, it helps me uh, through a number of ways. Um, I just want uh, to... So let's just run through them, because some people don't know how, how the subscriptions really do help creators. Uh, so basically, the first thing is that uh, it puts money in my pocket so I can spend it on whatever I want uh, and, and that's it 
So thank you all for supporting uh, such a such a low down uh, small streamer like myself. Uh, thank you for the hundred bits. Uh, yup, sure, okay. Meaty bumhole, you subscribe using Twitch Prime. Thank you for the support. Thank you, thank you. Dragon Noodle, I, I don't want to. I want to make sure I don't miss you. <laughs> Bum fight. <laughs> I love supporting you. Yeah. Bum fight. It, was that what that thing was called with Doctor Phil, where the dude dressed up as Doctor Phil? That was actually hilarious. The, the, they're both pieces of shit, but we've talked about it on the podcast. Blah, 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 blah. Thank you for showing us Lego. Anytime. Why don't you say we just get this... I'm coming out. You know? So let's uh, just start with it and, and pray a little bit. Pray a little bit. Zane, man... 001, you resubscribed. This has been going on for three months. You've been subscribing. You poor soul. You've subscribed for a total of three months to the channel. You you supportive, naive Zane. Thank you. Then we got Shrub Ultra who subscribed. Thank you. I'm sorry I missed Trev. I'm I'm looking at chat. I'm I'm combing through. It's there's just so many people to scroll through. So chat, I don't. There, I, I had a number of ideas in my head. There was like, I could do a watch party, uh, and I would, could watch Jackass 2 with chat. Um, that was one thing I, I was thinking of doing. I was gonna be like, I'm just gonna play Halo 3 on normal so I can relax and just kind of talk to chat. Um, but y'all remember we used to do these types of streams uh, fairly often back in the day. By that I mean a year ago. Someone else said hi, Trevor. Where the fuck are you hiding, you son of a bitch? Yeah, it would be through Amazon or however people do it. I know streamers tend to just record their screen and do a watch party. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah through the Amazon shit. But wouldn't like everyone else have to rent Jackass too? And then it's just me sitting here, just haha. <laughs> would I have to put up text being like, watch Jackass? Uh, we're watching Jackass 2, link in description or something. I don't know where I'd put the link. Link in chat. Find link in chat. Or ask for link in chat. Jesus. Turt snack. You gifted one subscription. And then we got Purana. Purana, you gifted one, two, three, four, five subscriptions. Jesus, thank you. Thank to the both of you. Yana, you resubscribed. This is two months you've been with us. Thank you. Bless. Layton was doing a YouTube watch party thing, and he just had himself green screened on the bottom. I mean, yeah, I mean, I could just, uh, I don't know. I, I don't know if I'm, I don't know if I'm like, I want to, I mean, what is it? I, I pull up. Uh, what is it? Extreme near-death compilation. And then every time something happens, I'm going to go, Oh! <gasps> Charging battery. Charging battery. You know what I mean? Halo 3 is always fun. But part of me feels like if I'm going to do a stream of just like a chill Halo 3 playthrough, it's only it only takes four to five hours, especially if you're playing on normal. So maybe that should be saved for a full ass stream. Play Sifu. I don't. I didn't get it on the Epic Store. I have it on the PlayStation Five. Um, I talked to my buddies over at Sony, and they said, "Here, have." They, they gave me five PS Fives first, and so I didn't know what to do with them. Uh, I I gave one a bath. Um, I I tried to sell the other ones. Made a made a good buck off of about two of them, and then. So now I'm down to two left. One, of course, I'm taking personally. And the other, honestly, if I'm being honest, I have no idea where it is. I put it up somewhere. It's in storage or something. <sighs> Sell them for profit. I will eat your pea snow cone. I saw that jackass stunt. Uh, it's a number one. It's near the end, I believe. Uh, I watched Jackass 1 with um, Leighton recently, 
uh, Gaten. Clara, thank you for the five gifted subs. You son of a bitch. Those are five people that now will be uh, updated on when I'm streaming. So that is great. Za Zacharoni tipped five fucking dollars. Uh, just took a break to say some prayers. The Lord spoke to me through the good book. So here's five dollars. Thank you very much. And Josiah or jo Josiah Sh Joe shit. I don't know. <laughs> the Joe shit. Joe, whatever. You resubscribed for three months. Thank you. Watch funny super mega comp. No, I'm not going to watch my own shit. I'd, I'd, that's the last thing I'd want to do is like react to my own shit. I, I kind of, unless it's a sketch or something, I, I usually tend to like to record it and leave it be after that. Unless Justin throws in something that he's proud of and sends me something on on a good old Snapchat or text, a little clip that he edited. Ryan hates his own content. Only uploads it for money. Uh, you're not wrong. I do love money. Katarina, Katarina, whatever. Cat. Uh, there we go. One, two, three, four, five. You have gifted five subs. Thank you. So this stream is just going to be me getting money. I'm just going to sit back. And let the let the subs come in, and uh, I'll look. I'll glance at chat, and uh, sounds good. <laughs> raspberry, raspberry. Uh, thank, thank you, R raspberry. Thank you. <laughs> Evil ass, mig. <laughs> Unsubbin. Trevor laugh. Gosh, oh, <laughs> you guys. Do I sound like Trevor? That's crazy. ASMR stream. ASMR stream solving a. Uh, I don't know. Get some fun sound. What is this? Dust cleaning gel. Get some nice ASMR out of this, maybe. You know? Ooh. Doesn't that look fun? Doesn't this just look wonderful and nice and fun to play with? supposed to get the dust off of your keyboards and mountain and all this other shit but let's see does it even make noise nope and I it's not even in a tight enough spot where I can do the funny funny fart noise but look at it looks like a pair of it looks like s balls not anymore Ugh. Sorry, some got my ma Nah. Thank you for the bits. You keep calling me Joe Shit Lamel. I'm gonna have to change my username now. <laughs> hey, you know, you, you you come here we're we're I'm just uh I'm doing the best I can in terms of reading. Manic House Cat, thank you for the 100 bits as well. Then we got War of 1812, who subscribed. Ryan, try Outer Worlds or Ark. Uh, be a space pirate or tame dinosaurs. I have played both of those. Outer Worlds I enjoyed, although I didn't beat it. I got to a certain point and then I fell off of it. May have gotten into something else. And then um, Ark, I played a, a lot with uh, Justin and Kelly and our friend Straighten. Um, Coral. Ryan, I did fall off. I'm, I'm sitting here playing with dust cleaning gel. Not knowing what to do. So I just thought I'd come here and talk to chat. This is probably the most I've talked to chat for the 23 days, the 25 whatever fucking days I've been back. Thank you for coming to the theater, by the way. See? You got right there, right over there. Hop on the SMP. Have you played Minecraft? I have played Minecraft. 
Nah, we chilling. SMP already dead. Uh, I mean, I'm, I'm going to hop back on again. In fact, I don't know if it... It might have been sarcasm, but apparently uh, I saw one of Layton's streams was like, everyone's on the epic SMP. Could have been a little bit. Look what I did. Anyways, um... You should save all your Twitch history. Well, I would have to have made history to save it, so... Still working on that part, but thank you. Epic SMP really fell. It's just I don't know. It's it's it. I kind of like the fact that it's more of a chill server that a certain like a few people come to every now and then. It doesn't always have to be popping, and plus people want to stream other games. People want to do other things, and it like it, it it's there. It's there. Do it's there doing its thing. Come on stream, best content. <laughs> Done. Um, so let's actually, uh, we're, we're 23 minutes into stream. Let's, let's, let's pray off of it. You should give truck sim another shot. I'm, you know, I have it downloaded. I do have it downloaded. Oh, I fucking hate the menus in that game. It's like, I just, maybe I should, nah. see, I, sometimes I like playing a game for like 30 minutes to an hour on my own before streaming it. So I'm like. A little loosened up. Would you play Master Chief Collection Halo 3? Yeah, I would. That was one of the... Almost, uh, plans tonight. Didn't know you were a cigar guy. <laughs> it's, uh... Yeah. Like, uh, like Steven Crowder. Louder with Crowder. Oh my god. What a fucking guy. An unfortunate rabbit hole that a lot of people sometimes will fall into is watching bullshit like that. Whatever your political views are, you can add whatever. It just, I think he's a jackass. I think a lot of people think he's a jackass. In fact, some might say that's his, that's his marketing strategy. Also, we got Roach, with, a, with, a, with, with who subscribed a few seconds ago, and Sir, Sir, mm. Chloe. It's the last part of it. Twenty-one fucking months. That might that might be the longest subscription that you're actively. A lot of that, I there's no way I have I have streamed actively for twenty-one months. So I apologize that you're continuing to support me. After time and time again being tested. Paid to boo. Thank you. Thank you. Happy to be here. I like I like bringing this back. Spy, thank you for subscribing. Uh, I like bringing this back. Just chill nights. We used to call it Bible study in my older stream days. I think your finger's on fire. <laughs> yeah. Yuck, yuck. This is chill. How can you hear the music in the background at all? The Donkey Kong shit. Oh, right now it's the aqua. Mind if we play the aquatic track again? It's so good, and I, and I might want to turn it up just a tad, just a tad, just right there. Tell me if that's too. If it, you know, if that might be too loud. I'll, 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 I don't know. You tell me. Should I put it back up here? <laughs> no. How about now? Where is it? Yes, I really... Okay. It's good. There we go. Louder. Okay. Are you sure? I just don't want... I'm watching because when it gets close to yellow, that means it's close to my level. And so I'm looking out for that. I'll play Kirby Music. Oh, you know what? Because this is a long ass playlist, but oh, I am not like I I love Kirby, blah blah blah. I never really supported every Kirby game, or really many Kirby games. I think the only Kirby game I played and made it all the way through was Nightmares and Dreamland for the Game Boy Advance. I remember, I think it was for the Game Boy Advance. I remember being at my grandmother's house and just 
not paying attention to anything going on in terms of like the family. It's all adult conversation. I'm a kid at that point. And I remember being so frustrated by the final boss. So fucking frustrated. But I beat it at my grandmother's house. And that was a good game. I never played Air Ride. I never played... The, the new Kirby looks interesting. The We're gonna take things to a... Post-apocalyptic looking ass place. Full mouth mode. Joe shit. <laughs> Thank you for gifting another sub. Subhuman trash heap. What a wonderful name. The Kerbussy got me acting up. Nice. Nintendo games bore me, says Oki with uh, Dino. That's uh, it, the chat scrolled up. But um, for me, Nintendo games usually fall into the realm of like a breath of fresh air because uh, the games I get obsessed with a lot of the time are the two standard types of games that exist and like the only two types of games that kind of exist. I mean, I know there are outliers and there are a lot of outliers in this case, but like the two mainstream games are the open world games where you, where there's a bunch of waypoints, you collect a bunch of shit, you collect a bunch of cool looking outfits that you can wear and look badass in, your Red Dead Redemptions, your Horizon Zero Dawns. And then you have your your action uh, first person shooters those are the two uh games that like are two types of games that i probably put most of my hours into i don't know where sea of thieves would fall into that that is kind of like a that is a first person action game with shooting so you get to pass it or ooh, so, so, sorry games with lots of yeah i, li I like the, i like grinding but okay okay Let's let's get into it. I love grinding in games. I am one of those people that will fall in love with it. So uh, you have a, might have a thousand hours. I have. I definitely have. I oh, what does it say? I have. I checked today. It was forty nine days and eight hours. Hold up. So I have one thousand one hundred and eighty four in Sea of Thieves. That's probably the most time I've put into any game ever and I love it I never played Ape Escape unfortunately Jesus Christ. and they're they're the streamers out there that stream Sea of Thieves they have like I think I don't know if it was a joke but it's like 10,000 hours plus oh here we go I like grinding Pokemon and just see here's where I was here's the hot take I think the grinding in Pokemon Legends sucks. I hate it. I don't like it. I'm not a fan. I got bored very quickly. And like my brain understood that this was the type of grind that I was not interested in. And that's just me being kind of like a little nit like a little picky bitch about it, you know? Because um, there are games I understand where the grind that I'm doing is actually just torture. For example, in Sea of Thieves, getting the gold curse was not fun. Uh, it was just stupid, uh, the amount of uh, hours you have to do just to replay everything. And I did most of it solo, and I didn't do, like, checkpoint shit. Because I, I just kind of followed the guides and went straight through them after doing them the first time. I have played Stardew. I put a bunch of hours in Stardew. Anyways, so, but like, here's the thing. At the end of the day, that grind led to an achievement that I earned, even though it's only purely cosmetic. It led to something that uh, feels rewarding, that I carry, that only a certain sect of people, blah, 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 can carry. And I also feel that same way when I like grinded out the Sekiro trophies, like the platinum, because a part of Sekiro in completing that platinum is to grind. Like you have to grind, you have to, spawn up in a the Ashina castle and kill a bunch of monks there are a bunch of routes you can 
to go out. There's there are like three routes that I used. The most profitable one was like when everything was in flames near the end. And it's kind of in the front of Ashina Castle, I think. More so where the you fight the ogre the first time. But Pokebot. I guess I just wasn't wowed or anything by the by the world and I didn't like exploring the environment and I think that's something big in an open world game you at least want your environment to look pretty or something where you're like I want to go look at this and I didn't get that and I and I and I will say I didn't I haven't played that much a uh, Pokemon I played a few hours maybe 10 at most but the grind is just kind of like Go to the same spot and see if you can catch the thing you want. And then after that, it's go and do that, except you're trying to catch one of a different color, which is cool. I love Red Gyarados, favorite Pokemon. And I get like shiny grinding, but the the grind of, of, of Arceus is just throw a shit ton of Pokeballs at everything and anything. And it just kind of like, I didn't like how it felt like this passive thing. That's probably like an old like head Pokemon type shit in my brain where I'm thinking, I, I always think that like catching a Pokemon is kind of like a big moment. Um, like it feels rewarding whenever you catch that Pokemon. So I didn't like that now it was just like, there are those moments in the game though, where it does challenge you with alphas and stuff. I, I recognize this, but I don't like that the, the base grind is chucking Pokeballs out like they're candy or just throwing a blueberry out for you to just them on the back. Arceus didn't really have a high skill level. I, I, yeah, I can see. But I mean, it does have a skill level because they do hard lock certain fights. Artificially through leveling, yeah. But like that, I feel like you do have to go through the grind to eventually be able to go up against that alpha that you want or whatever. Let's let's catch up on a uh, oh shit mayo. I glad to see you returning. Thank you for the donation slash tip. Uh, thank you, aquatic humanoid. I'll go check out that art by the way, mayo. Uh, aquatic humanoid subscribed, obsolete underscore eight 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 gifted a sub. Thank you for that. Bum fights with the hundred bits. You have a Kirby tattoo. Ooh, on my knee. Nice. I don't know who rake is rake it oh maybe may, i'm bad I, maybe i do fuck do i why did i say rake but did, did but you do why is it not ringing a bell it's probably because of this yup sure okay thank you thank you very much Hold on, we'll get, we'll get back to the Pokemon chat. Pokemon's canceled. <laughs> oh, I'm stupid. Yes. Okay. That's who you're talking about. I do know, yeah, I just didn't recognize him by name. I recognize him by face. Okay. Uh, also, Vickaboop. Thank you for the $10 tip earlier. That's five minutes ago. I'm an idiot. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm also slow at reading. Uh, I love what you do. Uh, how about things like grinding in Skyrim? Does that feel different from grinding something like Pokemon? Uh, yeah, I feel... I didn't get into Skyrim too much. I was more into, like... I, I remember being really addicted to Fallout 3. Fallout 4, I, I kind of quit, like, less than halfway through the story. Um... Hold on. Uh, I don't know if I really have much to say about Pokemon because the tr the hon like if I'm being honest, I don't think I played it that much to really go in depth. I just know that I kind of instinctually was like, no. 
I am the same jackass who did like Let's Go Pikachu. So keep that in mind. Do I have a favorite horror movie? Oh. Uh, Jaws. That's the movie that kind of got me excited about filmmaking. I've said this on the podcast and shit, but probably said it in the past stream, but like I I was a big baby growing up, so like I would get scared in general movie scenes that were creepy or even t television shows that were creepy. Um, I think of the Rugrats with the with Angelica's big baby brother. But like in terms of like pure terror, Jaws was like the first movie where I was like I shouldn't be watching this and it was fucking violent and brutal and scary uh, for a little kid who is already kind of like sharks are... I was still obsessed with sharks. I, I remember going through the like going in to the library and picking up books on sharks in like elementary school and then just writing down every shark and like the description of the sharks and like my own little uh what is it composition notebook I was literally just talking about Angelica's big baby brother <laughs> that shit was creepy big nostalgic hit with Rugrats for me is the Vegas uh vacation uh is it like Rugrats Vegas Vacation? It's the one where at the end Angelica sings Vacation. Vacation, you know? Thank you. Uh, A. Asim Asimar. Ugh, fuck me, dude. That, but you subscribe, so thank you. Let's sub I don't like horror. I like thrillers, though. Okay. Respect. I like horror when I like it. <laughs> That's the best way I can put it. Uh, or I, uh, like with games, it has to be good for me to enjoy it. Because if it's like bad horror that just like has cheap jump scares, it just annoys me. Because I jump easy. And it's not like I'm terrified in the situation. It's just a loud noise. Like I, I, I just jump easy. Gore fests are rare for me to like. There's some that are like fun, but some, but most of the ones that are fun aren't in the horror genre or the ones that I find fun. Think of like Dread. I I don't know if that's like a gore fest, but it was pretty. Gore. It was there's a lot of gore in that one. Judge Dread. Why are you in a closet though? Look, I'm sorry I don't have fucking blue and pink neon strips lighting up the windowsill and a lava lamp and a little fake fish tank and a, a fucking doggy cam. But you know what I do have? Oh, hold on. To read chat. <laughs> you don't have shit. No, I don't want my hair. I just washed it recently, and like right after, you know, I only wash it once a year. <laughs> but like whenever I like thoroughly do like shampoo and conditioning, I find that it gets like super light and more like frizzy at the start. Um, I like it when it calms down a bit. Can you whip a nene on stream? I, I can't. An ugly loser is tipped 10 effing dollars. I, I really recommend the show uh, Vox Machinima on Prime. Oh, there's a lot of a lot of shows uh, that I need to get into. Queen's Gambit I want to watch. I want to watch Cowboy Bebop. I guess I'll watch the Peacemaker show. Because James Gunn was attached to, like, the main start of it. 
First, I was scared the Donkey Kong music start stopped. I don't think much of anything, right? Like, my last favorite run-through of a whole show that I haven't ever seen all the way through was Avatar Last Airbender. I remember as a kid catching episodes, but, like, you had to make it on time or you just didn't get the full story. Um, so I would catch episodes every now and then, but I never saw the full fucking thing front to back without any bullshit in between and all that. So... I I went through all of it and fucking loved it. There's so many legitimately beautiful moments in that show that are awesome. I have like my I I don't want to spoil shit. I don't want to Yeah, I don't want to spoil shit. But there's this this moment literally I think it's the last episode. There's this moment that is my favorite moment in all of the series and it and it and it made and it made me have butterflies <laughs> whisper it <laughs> Cor yeah i watched all of cora too there's there are definitely like strong beats um i think if whatever the spirit season was that season kind of lost me Everything else was just kind of like I I could bin I binged it. Is it the duel? Yeah, there's a moment in that duel. There's a specific cinematic moment in that duel at the at the, at the end. That's just like it's so well executed, and I it's it's obvious of course, but like the music and. What they're able to do, like, I, part of, I think a big part of it was, like, this was on fucking Nickelodeon. Or, yes, a bunch of, like, famous shit, like, think of Spongebob, but, like, this felt a step above, you know? This mo there are several moments like it, but, ugh, fuck, such a good moment. I'll geek over it. Thank you again, an ugly loser. Uh, earlier for being way too generous fried meme chef used your twitch prime subscription thank you how do you watch movies without feeling restless uh sometimes i just turn off my phone and throw it across like wherever and i just force myself to pay attention because that's what i do in a theater so i try to immerse myself I didn't fully appreciate it as kids, but now I literally get it more. It's so fucking beautiful. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna share the. I'm gonna. I'm gonna say the moment. If if you don't want to be spoiled, I'll I'll give you a thumbs up. Mute now, and I'll give you a thumbs up when I'm done spoiling. When I'm done with the moment, and then don't read chat for a bit. P potentially. And it's like a big moment, so I don't think it's a surprise. I'm leaving. Have a good goodbye, unsubbing. But I. Not yet, not yet. Keep it muted. Keep it muted. Mute now. It's the moment during the duel where Aang has a moment to deflect the lightning uh, at the Fire Lord, and he chooses not to. And it, it's more of like, because he's been struggling with, like, does he have to take someone's life? Like, does taking... No matter how evil they are, just taking this person's life, like, does that act justify? Like, can he be justified in doing that? And fuck. Ugh. So good. Anyways, we're all good. And if you read my lips during that, you're stupid. <laughs> Dude, spoilers. Hey, I, I gave y'all a warning. a bitch for that. That one fucks. God, that was so powerful. And the theme of revenge and ethics of woven through the whole thing. Such a yes, it is. It fucking is. 
as I said, there are plenty of moments that happen throughout the series that really excite me. But that was the moment. I think that was the moment where I was like, I'm going to rewatch this. This is like a classic now to me in terms of like shows. Like when I think of good shows, right there. Look, I'm just talking in a closet with Donkey Kong music with chat. And for people who watch this VOD later, it is just me looking at my monitor and talking and sometimes giving context to what I'm responding to. Yikes. <laughs> Welcome, Toasty. Ryan, why do you like film so much? Like, I'm not like... My whole life isn't like based around it, right? It's just something I really do... Like when I see a good movie, I get excited and I get, I get as I said before, butterflies. Um, I was just, I watched a lot of movies growing up. So did a bunch of, I mean, so did everyone. But I really went above and beyond in playing make believe when I was young in terms of like the movies and really, I mean, I'm just talking about a kid's imagination. I feel like most people had this, but I think another part of it is like. I'd go to the, you know, my parents were divorced and a big bonding thing my dad and I would do would be to go to the movie theater and go see a movie. Um, so there are a lot of like, I, I, I remember my first, seeing my first R-rated film, not in terms of just ever, but in theaters. Uh, with, express, like with someone, because I, my mom cheated and got us into, got me and my friends when we were younger into The Collector. That old horror movie, which I own on Blu-ray. It's 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 fun and dumb, The Collector. I don't know if anyone has ever seen it, but I think it's a very fun and and dumb movie. It's Home Alone. It's just R-rated Home Alone is all it is with bugs. Oh, I mean Home Alone has has a spider, so boom, it's all it's already there. It could just be like some director's edgy edgelord take on Home Alone. This is what Kevin is like now that he's grown up. I'm never, hey, if you like horror. Also, I don't know if this counts as horror, but I really like the movie and I think it's a cult classic of such and I think people should watch it. Has Betty White in it, huh? It's called Lake Placid. It's, a, it's essentially a dark comedy slash like satire on the Jaws type, except it's play, it kind of plays itself seriously a lot, but it does. It's very. It's also tongue. It's it 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 does good at writing that line. I, I have that's a it's a good it's a good one. More like, like, yeah, I knew as soon as I said placid, someone's gonna, someone's gonna say something. <laughs> Way to bring up Betty White, you asshole. Look, Trevor, she's an American icon. Was an American icon. What's up, Grinches? What up? Bo... Bohem... Bohemus? Subscribed with Twitch Prime? Wow. I don't, I don't like dead people. <laughs> yeah, Betty White really fucking fell off, didn't she? I mean, what's she, what's she doing these days? Lazy sack of bones. Have some class. Lamau, <laughs> stop. Dead people are disappointing. <sighs> Just not as good as when they were alive. Will you be streaming Elden Ring? No, I will enjoy that one on my own. Probably just, uh, I don't know, There's as I've said this before, same thing that I do with the channel. There are some games that I prefer not to feel like I'm in some sort of spotlight while playing it. Turn that music, looks a little loud. Wow, fuck, we're listening to fuck. 
course, we're at Funky's place. Let's do Misty Menace. <laughs> Talk shit about Betty White, SMH, unsubscribed. Uh-oh. A. ASMRs? Why do I keep fucking up names? Why? But... <laughs> Thank you for... Gifted another sub. As well as, uh... Bohemus. Uh, one, two, three, four... Five gifted subs. Let's fucking go. Ass, mister. <laughs> it's a... I... What... What is it? A... A... Come on. How do you think it's pronounced, chat? If you're so smart... Asimar? <laughs> Asmer? Asmer? As, ass mister? Man is losing brain. I am! Every time I smoke, I lose brain cells. I mean, pray. It's because I'm giving my brain cells to God. I just tuned in. What's going on? I'm just kind of chilling with chat. Not not much is going on, but thank you for stopping by, Ryan. Who I I don't play enough Smash to have a main. I like being annoying with the Bowser Junior people. They're really annoying. I also like being annoying with uh, King K. Rule. Who else? <laughs> I mean, I think I think what. It, I, I really like the Bowser Jr. Because, like, since I can't fight worth shit, I'll just always be jumping around. And the animation they have for them is that they just kind of, like, rotate and go upside down. And it, it makes me laugh because I'm a child. Um, so I just kind of bounce around <laughs> and annoy people. It's 6, it's 6 30 a.m.? Yeah, you should, you should probably... Get some, get some sleep. I can't fight worth shit. I can't. Fighting games don't click with me. Sifu is already hard enough for me as it is. That's kind of a fighting game, but in terms of the, let's let's keep it like the two D or the the straight the fixed camera uh, fighting games. Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat. I get you. Smash Bros and PlayStation Brawlers and Nickelodeon Toon Punch or whatever, you know. I suck at those games. They never click with me. I tried. I tried with Mortal Kombat. I really tried to learn. I was looking up the combos, practicing, and then I'd get into a fight and then I'd just end up button mashing. And I, I would always revert to that. I will be playing Elden Ring, but not on stream. Just on my personal time. It looks fun. As F. Sorry to hear that, Mayo. My week's been alright. Just win, Lamel. Are you excited about the new Mario Kart? So they announced that they're working on the next one. That's not coming out for another year or two. Or at least... De definitely. Because the new... They announced... How many new courses? How many was it? It was a... Shit. 48, right? Oh my god. I was, I was about to say 48, but then in my head I was like, no, that's stupid. But a lot of them are remasters of older levels. Or all of them are. Or they're like mixed some new...
I have seen Switch Sports. It, uh, I'm just excited for tennis. Tennis was my favorite Wii sport. Uh, the sound design, everything about Wii Tennis. I thought, I thought playing Wii Tennis felt the best out of all the other games. Forty-eight remastered tracks in six waves up until twenty twenty-three. I mean, it is a good Mario Kart game, so why not? Why not milk it for everything it has? Sounds like Metroid music. Well, you'll be happy to know that this is actually Northern Hemispheres from Donkey Kong Country. We're, we've all we're kind of close to the end, and then. Uh, someone said we should listen to some Kirby music. What's the best? Oh, Kirby music. I don't know if I like that. I like this music though. Yeah, I mean, we've been listening to the whole soundtrack. We can we can listen to Donkey Kong Country 2 soundtrack full next actually. Donkey Kong uh, 64 soundtrack is a little too bananas sometimes. Cuphead, no, I don't want to... Cuphead music will make me feel like I'm in a nightmare. Because that's all it was, was just like... Listening to the music. And then... Time for another... It's just... Never ending. I love the soundtrack. I, I own the soundtrack. I respect it, I love it. But... I, I think it's conditioned me to feel anxious. Breath of the Wild soundtrack is great. Okay. Well, Trevor, you got to pick one. Donkey Kong Country 2 soundtrack full or Breath of the Wild soundtrack full? You, you, you got to pick one, buddy. Breath of the Wild, okay. And that's going to be starting up here in about 13 minutes. I have not seen the new uh, Cuphead Netflix show, and I'm gonna be honest, I don't think I'm that interested. From the trailer, it gave me the vibe that it was just, oh, the obvious uh, voices, and then them going, you know, them doing that. Maybe it's not, maybe it's not, and I'm, and the trailers just gave it a little bit of a, a bad light. But... <laughs> wow, that sound canceling. Yeah. I don't want to get too loud. I feel like I'm about to die anytime I hear the Abyss Watchers theme song, man. Dark Souls. Oh. Yeah. Same shit with... Oh. I need to do Sekiro on stream. What I would really want to do actually is not the game. I'd, I'd want to do the gauntlets. I just need to finish up. There's this playthrough that I started that I kind of fell off on. I was doing like a charmless demon bell run. And now I'm thinking I might just cancel that shit, finish it up so we can just get to ga streaming the gauntlets. Because I want a specific ending. Or I want to get to the ending before I start running them. I've already I've already played some of the gauntlets. I I've I've, pur I've purposely not beaten any of them. I have pra I like that you can practice bosses now because some of the bosses are so fun. Go play in Sekiro and get mad if you want. There are a lot of guides that you can use on YouTube that are very helpful in terms of boss encounters and stuff. Man, if you stream Stardew, I'd fuck your dad. Um, my dad is is fine okay he's got I can't remember if it was six or five six or five wives he doesn't like the term feels it's very it's like societally bounding or something like that I can't remember it's some whatever he's talking about <laughs> mistresses Y'all Sekiro playthrough helped me get through it all. 
What specifically did uh did you use the cheese for the corrupt uh monk? That's just like if I don't feel like dealing with it, it's easy to throw dust in her face. Or what specifically helped you? I'd be interested to know. Emo. Emo Tony Soprano. With the dark green chat name. Wait, Ryan, would you ever be down to co-op some Stardew? I I'm down. I've never done multiplayer Stardew. It's the only way I can play that game. My favorite thing is to go fishing and go mining. Go in the mines, go to some little slimes, maybe some, some little rock monsters. See, you can take care of the farming and crops and I can go get some fish. I can go mine some good materials. I'll go out to work. I'll be, you'll say, I'll see you later. Now I'll give you a little, you know, I'll give you a little with a little before it. The only part I like about Stardew is taking care of the animals. I, I, ne I want to, I want to, I, I want to play Harvest Moon, A Wonderful Life, kind of. Take care of some cows, get some, get some really good quality milk, you know? I would love seeing you play Slime Rancher. Slime Rancher looks good. It looks very satisfying and just kind of like relaxing to play. And I know that there are parts when people, oh, you think it's relaxing. I know there are parts that aren't relaxing, but I, for the most part, it's a cute game, I would imagine. I've never played it too. And that'd be, that'd be something I don't think I'd like care to have my, f I need to play this on my own. Like I would Elden Ring. I think I would, I'd do like first First reaction on stream. Yeah, I'm itching myself. What of it? Thank you for the hundred bits, bum fights. Will you be my Stardew Valley husband? No. But thank you. I'm honored to even be considered. I genuinely can't stand people who are like, oh, you think this is relaxing? Yeah, you must have not gotten late game. Uh, do you remember Bubblegum Forest? <laughs> Fucking amateurs. Those types? Yeah. You know, there, there are moments where, like, before we played it on the channel where I was like, oh, if I don't at least play heroic, people are gonna say shit because I'm playing on normal. I don't give a shit. Normal is so relaxing. I can like focus on chat and focus on shit or focus on conversation with Matt when we did the Let's Play way back when. Now, if it was a stream all about like getting like fuck, I'd go, str I'd do legendary. Maybe not lasso. Lasso is too aggravating. Those people, those fucking people. Yeah, you think this is relaxing? Wait till you play the game on heroin. Beowulf followed? What a great movie, Beowulf, by the way. The scene where bowls and, and like food are hiding his cock and his sword is hiding his cock. Such a good movie. And Angelina Jolie's kind of naked in it. Is Beowulf that CGI movie? Yeah, it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the weird-looking one. 
Ryan, what is the best ride at Disney World or Land? Uh, there's two that I really like. Um, no, I know that music's loud. I love the Carousel of Tomorrow. That might just be my default favorite one. I love that. But next to that would probably be like Rock and Roller Coaster because it's like the only thrill ride that they have. And it's fun. Carousel of Progress, that's it. It's a great, big, beautiful tomorrow Shining at the end of every day Something like that It's a great, big, beautiful tomorrow Yep How dare you not say Haunted Mansion? Well... Haunted Mansion is cool and all. <sighs> but Pirates of the Caribbean is better. <sighs> Cancel me, chat. Yeah, I have opinions about Haunted Mansion. What of it? I like the Pirates of the Caribbean ride. You get to go by and see people eating mediocre food. Hello. Haunted Mansion mid. Let's get all the Disney stands in here. Fuck Haunted Mansion. Most overhyped bullshit. Disney or Univ Disney over Universal? Mm. No. Universal actually has days where it is deserted. Like, no lines for shit. Deserted. Um. So, you know, you can get, you know, you get some drinks... Maybe you find a pen that you didn't bring in. Uh, and you get a little fun. Wait, how much of a weed tolerance you got by now? Like, how much do you need to take to be gone? I don't like getting gone, so I don't really like getting myself to that point. I don't like going, like, where I'm like, whoa, you know, like that type of shit. Or, I mean, what, that's a stereotype. But... You know what I mean. I kind of like getting buzzed. Ryan doesn't, <laughs> doesn't like to get... I don't. I, I like... Sounds start to make me nauseous. And I, I don't want to do anything, but just like... I can't even think. Disney or Gatorland? Never been to Gatorland, unfortunately. But if you said Carowinds, I would I would have an opinion. Who's been to Carowinds? And don't lie, none of y'all. Not one motherfucker has been to Carowinds. <sighs> nope. <sighs> the heck is that? <laughs> Me. Oh yeah, Sharp. Carowinds is was fucking sick. Until, like, Paramount pulled the plug on, like, them being able to use their shit and they had to change all of their property names. Or their ride names. Scene. Wow, thank you for subscribing, Meats. That's a, that's a, that's a, that's a Twitch Prime subscription. Do you like going to aquariums? Yes. Aquariums are awesome. My favorite type of museum, I would say. Museum. Zoe, welcome. Wow, look at you. Yeah, find, I hope you found a seat all right. You gonna do cold ones again? I'd love to. I told Matt, if we're doing cold ones again, the challenge is he gets like a beer and then I just get completely trashed and it's a just a reverse. Except for me, I'd probably just sleep. I might stomp everywhere. I might, I might go in the toddler mode. Uh, 
bathroom. <laughs> Oh, guess what? Breath of the Wild. Hey, I don't know if Trevor's still here, but I have to honor the agreement. Breath of the Wild soundtrack. Six hours. Let's go. It's a classic LA story. My shh, shh, no, don't. No. No, 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 no. Let's not. Come on, let's let's skip the ad. Okay. Let me let me let me get a let me get a let me get a little. I'm gonna go a little in. Cause it's six hours. Interesting. Wonderful. I'm kind of scared the second game is just going to be the first one again. I think it I think I will like it either way. Yeah, it's just I think it's why I fell off of the Assassin's Creed series is because you can only do so much of the same shit, you know? I fell off. I didn't play Black Flag, but I played Freedom Cry, which was the, a DLC for uh, Black Flag. I know Black Flag is like a lot of people's favorites. I see y'all talking about it in chat, but I... Just three made me not care for the series anymore. I don't know if I have a favorite Midwest emo band. I'm sorry. Anal. Wow. Thank you for subscribing with Twitch Prime. You should play Final Fan Final Fantasy. Usually, it doesn't really align with my tastes. Don't really align with that type of game. Small brain. Nah, Black Flag brought it back. Yeah, but I mean. I, I came back for the one in Egypt. And then I fell off of that after a bit. But I played a lot of it. Because it's like you can go hunt shit and get materials to unlock. I don't know. Uh, and then did I play anyone after that? What's the? I think that's the last one I played. I... I think I tried to play Valhalla, but the Ubisoft app was being weird and it just wasn't allowing me to play it. So I was like, if like make it easy for me to play the game. If you're gonna make me jump through all these hoops, then I'm 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 gonna go play something else. I can't remember what was Ubisoft. <laughs> How often do you play your Switch compared to PlayStation or Xbox? I play mostly on my PC. And then I'd say PS5 and Switch are tied for playtime. PS5 leaning more so right now. And then Xbox, I, I really don't touch anymore. Because anything I would play on the Xbox, I just play here now. Sea of Thieves, Halo... I haven't, uh, I, I didn't, I have not finished the battle pass. I have not played Fortnite in probably over a year, maybe. Interested in any upcoming games this year? What was it called? There's this one game. 
Oh, it's like a first person paranormal Tokyo something. What? Is, uh, hold up. What is it called? Ghostwire Tokyo. Let's see. Here. I'll make it so we can we can watch it. We can watch the trailer so I can show y'all if y'all haven't seen it or heard of it. Uh, let's see. This is just... Let me just... It, it, I don't know if you'll get a good... Whatever. Okay, let's just test it out. Hold up. Uh, and then stream, and then, hold up. Yeah. Go, you'll see. I'm about to, I think, go, yeah. This game. I'm it just looks interesting, and I'm excited for it. This is whatever. I think it... Something happened with developers, though. I don't know. Maybe my brain's fucking shit up. But the, but the advertising for the game at first was definitely a different vibe than whatever this turned into, but it still looks interesting to me. I'm still gonna check it out. Slender man. <laughs> yeah. How'd I know? <laughs> it's called a ghost wired Tokyo. Yeah. So this is a game that's coming out eventually that I'm at least somewhat interested in seeing what it's all about. I'm kind of upset that a lot of the powers kind of look, have that digital glitch effect that kind of wanted them to not be that but it's fine just a f fighting a bunch of fun ghoulish creatures maybe some big scary bosses my fingers light up I go destroy some of them <laughs> I love how you're excited to share this off to everyone but everyone be like slender hey you know Those who grab the low-hanging fruit first are the ones who survive. Just going to be honest. I know how it is. That's what I do in the podcast. I mean, there's Elden Ring. I mean, like, what else has been, like, shown? Let me see. Usually I mark down things that I'm excited for in this, like, countdown thing. Yeah, the next thing is the Cuphead DLC. I mean, there's Shifu already came out. Elden Ring's coming out in five days or whatever. Cuphead DLC is like 130 days. Horizon Forbidden West is two, oh, two days ago. So I'll, I guess I'll play that at some point. Oh, what happened to our background music? It couldn't have been that I switched over. Hold on, we'll continue. There. How's that? Are you ending soon? I don't know. Should I end soon? <laughs> Bro, can you dance? Nope, I have no rhythm. Have you played Sifu? Yes. I... Trying to think, my best playthrough. I got below 30 on the club. It was like 26 or 28. But I'm still kind of grinding that out because I want to. I want to get that 
down a little bit. I want to try to exit the club at like 25. That would be my goal. But you're learning rhythm with boxing. Yeah, dancing, choreography, and boxing are kind of a... I feel like it would be better if you knew dancing and then did boxing than to do boxing and then learn how to dance. I mean, it's still like footwork and shit, but like I feel like it's... I feel like one leads better into the other. Not going to beat Sean before 30. Way too hard. You can. You can. The only thing that gets me... Okay. So, in Sifu, in, that, in, the, in the second boss, once you get his sweep attack down, that's really the only thing that really would give you any trouble because it's all just like, like a rhythm of ducking uh, his attacks and then just punishing him. But there's this moment near the end of the last phase of that fight where he doesn't give you as big of an opening to land an attack on him or he's he, he becomes quicker and so having the you'll have to go through several of his combos like i like i'm having to right now later i'll be able to get the rhythm more and probably cancel out some of the attacks and be a little more up front and, and brutish in the fight but Ryan box me one shot to the head. What have you been listening to? Okay, well, what have I been listening to? That's a good question. Um, let's see. I was just updated. New music for you. Rot. Tennyson. So. You should check. Most of y'all should know who that is. And you should go check out. Tennyson. Uh, thank you for entering the theater. Let's see. Uh, Let him in by by wings. Song two, blur. I heard it through the grapevine. Marvin Gaye. I want you back. The Jackson Five. Beautiful Girls Radio Disney version, Sean Kingston. California Dreamin', The Mamas and the Papas. In the Air Tonight, Phil Collins. Pretty Good at Drinking Beer by Billy Currington. So, so many different genres. Some goofy ones. Some serious ones. Some classics. That music, this music isn't sad people music. It's music. <laughs> Sean King. I like the Radio Disney version edit better. Because in the other version, he says, you, ha you got me suicidal. Which is such an immature viewpoint. Um of the situation there's no reason you should be suicidal over over these games this girl is playing with sean kingston you know but this girl's playing games with sean kingston's heart but there's no reason he should be feeling suicidal over it um so in the radio disney version it's you got me in denial and i think that's a very that it's more self-reflective, and I and I and I appreciate that interpretation of the great uh, Sean Kingston's work. <laughs> Sean Kingston and Incel for real. God damn, that's brilliant. 
loving this beautiful girl's Disney radio version analysis. Hey, that's what I'm here for. <laughs> you know, just breathing into the mic. Whoa, truth. Welcome. T take a seat. Appreciate you coming. Asmar. Asmars. Thank you for the hundred bits. Uh, what do you think about the current conflict in Israel uh, I think that and so it really just pretty much ends there in terms of what I think about it so yeah kind of a tricky situation I know but <laughs> that was a pretty bold statement I'm with you <laughs> dead ass Okay, chat. I recently, when, when Layton was over, I know people, I guess people have probably figured this out by now, but I was laughing my ass off. I went to the ASMR section of Twitch, and every time I would hit the next, it was the same fucking sound. It was just, it was just that every time then there would be one where there there was this girl make it seemed like she was making fun of it where she was like haha you know and all of a sudden i i clicked off i'm like okay good we there was one who wasn't the next did that and all of a sudden i went back to her i was like okay let's is she actually gonna do some asmr after she's goofing but i go back and then it was nothing but an endless sea of like wet noodle noises it's fucking weird technically I could we, we could probably catch it right now but I don't want to I just thought it was hilarious I was like no fucking way almost every because you just go down the list you just go next 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 and it was one of those microphones where it's the ears, the ASMR mics, and someone just really going to town on one of the ears. And I could just picture, like, just... Hold up. Hold up. Here, one second. We'll actually go to a stream and, uh... See if I can... Where are you? Hold up. After this ad, this is what it, this is this is what the viewers are going to be doing. I have my headphones on, so I got the full experience. Waiting for the ad to be done. Hold up. Come on. Let me guess. It's going to be. This is a thirty second. I swear to God, if it's two thirty second ads, chat. Hold up. Wait. I have it muted right now because it's just an ad. Here we are. <clears throat> This is a stream going on right now, so it's just... So that's one. 
Let's go to the next one. Okay. Let's go to the very next one. Great. Hear it again. How about the one right next to this one? <laughs> that sounds like my dad at Chuck E. Cheese. How about the how about the very next one after this one? Multiple studies. I don't mean to like. Gain make I'm not trying zero. to say anything. I'm not trying to judge. I just think it's fucking hilarious. How every like one after the other. You're lying. I'm not. I could I, I could share my screen and we could go through the first like 20 ASMR streams and it's just We don't need to hear more. Hey. <laughs> I know. As I said, I'm not I just think it's funny. That's it. That's it. That's that. That's where it ends. I'm not saying these fucking whores. They, they all they do is lap into the mic and they just get money from these fucking incels. No, I'm, people do whatever the fuck they want. It's their own hustle. Again, it's just goddamn funny. It's weird and funny. <laughs> I will say it is just weird and funny to me. This is a bit hectic. Let's fast forward. This is scary. Let's move. Should we just should we just pop in? Should we just pop into the ASMR? And just just so I can prove my point. Although y'all could do it yourself, but then it's like I'm asking y'all to do something. <laughs> the music. <laughs> Cue the evil music. You proved it, Ryan. We get it, please. But it's like, I don't get it. Oh, shit. Amaranth is on. Your future ex-wife licks your ears. I'm just scrolling down because it's f way funny. Okay. Yes, yeah, sign me up. Group Hal. Oh, ooga. <laughs> Why do I feel weird about, like, can I show this on stream? It's on Twitch. It's Twitch content. Licking your ears off. Okay. That sounds nice. I'm upset. Why are you, why are you upset? Okay, let's let's go a little. No. Ah. Chill. Banned for showing Twitch page. Oliver, thank you for the tip. Have you played Blasphemy? I I don't think I have. L X Z Y oh just Jakey, you gifted a tier one sub. Thank you. Thank you for doing that. It shouldn't be an issue as long as he's not bullying another. That's what I don't want this to turn into. And that's what I'm afraid and like very aware could happen. I don't want this to be like a... Oh, and it, like to start something. I don't want to have a backing of assholes of something in which that I don't support. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? I don't want to essentially do something and then I have people who support it that are at, that are just assholes. They're the ones that are like, 
upset that this is how people make their money. I will say that, you know, when it when it comes to the ASMR channel on Twitch, I think it's a beautiful thing. Such diversity in content. Y'all can listen to that music. I'm gonna turn it down. Because the music was loud as fuck. <laughs> it's giving so much gravity to your words. I'm just reading chat right now and uh, listening to the music. Hold on. Hold on one second. Just wait one second. Okay, I, I personally had to leave at the meowing. <laughs> that, that's where I had to leave. Not again. Order ASMR. <laughs> That'd be a fun game to play. <laughs> that was the best part. I had to stop it there. That was a little too much for me. You can tell by my reaction. This is abuse. It's not abuse. I'm not giving any streamers names. I'm not bullying them. I think it's... I think they know it's funny. I think they know, in the grand scheme of things, what they are doing when you boil it all down is hilarious. <laughs> oh, I'm abusing you? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, that's fine. How am I how am I abusing y'all? What is this getting into? Hey, you know. Godspeed. I love that one clip of the girl deep throating the ASMR ear mic. Shit funny. <laughs> Oh man. Uh I got to I got to check my email real quick, guys. Hold up. Hold on one second. I have Ooh. Yeah, nothing new. Nothing, nothing big. <clears throat> Can you fucking quit it? <laughs> I'm sorry, chat. Some of y'all are actually upset by this. <laughs> he has the headphones off. This isn't fair. <laughs> it's not. Oh shit, this stream's not still odd. Liars. There's no tab pulled up.
I could do an eating. I could do an eating some popcorn ASMR. Hold up. Where's my popcorn at? Not this skinny pop ASMR. <laughs> we'll get number one. That's the main goal. Is to take down Amaranth. With skinny pop ASMR. <laughs> you ripped that like... You ripped that open like a silver bag. Great, great primates, by the way. Silver bags. Now I just have popcorn in my teeth. You can single-handedly take her down, Ryan. It's about sending a message. Come on, name that movie chat. Come on, name that movie chat. There. I know that's some of y'all's favorite song. Or that... That's one of y'all's at least favorite song. Murray! Murray! <laughs> you know what my problem is, Murray? It's called Sea of Thieves, Murray. Not Sea of Friends. It Christian said, <laughs> yeah. Howdy, Riot. Season 6 of Sea of Thieves sued. I'm excited. I'm very, very excited for Season 6. Did the adventure. Got the compass memento thing. Um, so, yeah. I'm all set. I've, I've been at level 100 for a long time. I need a little more time in the arena. Just a little more time in the arena. Got some grinding to do still. So. But I am very excited for season six. I just fucking... Sometimes I just dip in and out. Like, I'll play for an hour. Sail to, like, two islands. See if there's a skeleton captain. I kill him. If there are, he drops a map. I dig up whatever it is, and I just go sell it. Sometimes I just go search for gem, like gems. 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 So I can get Hunter's Call. I'm, I'm almost at 44. I'm like a sliver away from 44 Hunter's Call. Getting to level 50 is going to be such a grind. We do the same thing, hello, our open crew for memes. I... There's this one time where I joined open crew, and it was on a brig, and they were just selling at Reaper's. And I made a fuck ton just by popping in. They were like, I was like, oh, sorry, I didn't really earn any of this. They were like, no, you, you're helping us turn it in. We, this is our least favorite part. I'm like, okay. You won the open crew lottery. I did. That was one time, though. Only once. 
I'm not really a big fan of Open Crew. I'm finna ooh woo. Resubscribe. This is seven months, but you used a Twitch Prime subscription. For those who don't know, a Twitch Prime a Twitch Prime subscription is when you have your Amazon Prime account and you attach it to your Twitch account. You then get a free subscription to any channel you want. Huh? Each month, you get a free subscription. Ryan, how do you feel when you see fans be too critical on the consistency of uploads? People can fucking complain about whatever they want to complain about. It's their God-given right. We have an update coming soon that'll hopefully... I'm let y'all in. But look, <coughs> I get it. I get it. You know, to an extent, we used to, in terms of like, I don't agree wholeheartedly. It's like I understand where they're coming from. Because a lot of the people came to the channel when we were busting our asses off. We were in the biggest grind we ever did in our fucking lives. We were editing at one point for, we've said this multiple times, Kitty Cat Gaming, uh, Game Grumps, which Game Grumps was doing a Steam Train, ep a Steam Train episode and then the two regular episodes. Uh, Oni plays for a small bit as well as our own shit. And we were trying to put up two videos a day on our own channel. So we were putting out a lot of content we were trying to really do the grind, you know, and it's not like we've made it and now we're buggering off. It's like, I don't feel like I always have to be in that grind mode. That's not, that's not what I set out to do. I didn't set out to, no matter what, make a let's play. Like, I, there's, it, it doesn't feel good to go into a room and to be like, what are we playing today? And like, to be like, ah, I'm not, I'm not really feeling it. So, like, cutting back on Let's Plays, uh, but only, like, doing the stuff that we like really helps us to kind of, like, not feel that. So we don't get winded as easily when we are recording. Like, WarioWare's, uh, the new WarioWare for the Switch was a really fun recording session. And we are, we've already completed, albeit two series, but we've, I mean, short series, we've completed two series this year. You know? We got Justin on, for one, which is always a treat. And then we did the WarioWare. And, you know, my opinions on... Pokemon, so we'll see how that goes, right? But thank you for subscribing, Alexander, comrade. But yeah, so like I get, like if you're used to a consistent upload of like those two uploads a day that we used to do way back when, or um, when we were like in our big kind of just grinding, as I said. It's it's more important that we're enjoying what we're doing because that just makes the content better. And unfortunately, we can't control whenever there's uh, shit when it comes to like our mental health or when it comes to just being out of ideas in general. Like mental health is one thing, you know, whatever. I don't want to use that as a crutch or an excuse. Um, but it's, it's, it's also like you do, you do go through creative droughts and we also shot a really awesome video recently that'll hopefully go out soon. <laughs> it's, it's going to be a good one. I got sick as fuck for this. <laughs> from rags to books. Yeah. But, you know, there are times, I will say, where I have been disappointed with the output of the channel. Like, there have been times where I'm like, fuck. But, we, we're, we're, we're gonna do better this year. We're just, Figuring shit out so we can get back on a good start again. 
keep an eye on the channel. Du -du 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 -du. Will you watch Boss? There's no way there's a Boss Baby 3. You jokester. You know, I was saying, hey, we're, we've just been chilling and talking for almost two hours. Usually these chill with chat streams do run shorter. Just because. It's the nature of them. I feel like this is just some battle music. This is nice. Getting the one million. Yeah, this will be the year we hit a million. And again, please keep in mind. I'm home. I'm relaxing. Probably shouldn't have even tried to go into detail. I'm also a little prayed up. So, like, don't take whatever I say as, like, this fully thought out, like, Here's what I'm going to say if anyone asks this on stream. You know. Bricked up and pr Yeah, that's us. Well, some of us. Jo- 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 Joses? Jo- Jow? Like George, like Jow, I don't know. J Jow, yes, Jowses. You resubscribed. You've been for two months supporting the McGee Live. That's me. I'm at McGee Live. Thank you for uh, coming in for that two month, for continuing to support. As well as Ecto Egg, you resubscribed, and you uh, got four months. Bada bing, bada boom. Prayed up and playing Outer Worlds. Nice. Ryan, stand up real quick. No. I'm good. Let's watch a full movie like Django Unchained. Ugh, I definitely couldn't do that starting now. I, uh, I did watch Django recently over uh, when I got COVID and I was quarantining with me and like four of my other friends <coughs> I would like to watch movies with stream if if I could get it set up to where it would be kind of smooth you know I don't, I don't think I could play the audio from movies or anything like that even I would have to actually just have something to be like we're watching blank go to the link in chat or type exclamation watch party in chat and I'll have it set up that way but it's like only a hundred people but I mean some people would have to rent the movie too but yeah I think it's only a hundred people on the Amazon watch party thing or we could all just press play at the same time and if people lose their spot due to buffering that's unfortunate Thank you for blessing me. Oh, if you just start a timer when you start the movie. Oh, I could get like just an overlay timer, download one that has a green screen on it, put it in here, and then just when I press play, I go. Then it's like, da 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 da, this is the time code. That perfect. That's a brilliant idea. Awesome. I would love to just watch shit with chat, but I, I don't know. Just like something about like even this is feels weird just to be chatting for a stream. It feels like I'm almost like, ah, I wish I could just delete this VOD afterwards. But um, yeah, and I would just imagine doing a movie when it's just 
oh, this part I really like. You know, I'd, I'd commentate, I guess, a little bit. And, like, I'd be reading chat. And we'd all be conversating while watching. And it would be that. But I don't know. It just it feels like all I'm doing is... Or at least this, I'm, I guess, interacting. It is, like, probably the lowest effort stream. But I'm at least doing some form of interaction consistently. And, like, when I'm... When I'm gaming, I'm focused in that, usually. Remember, small brain. Ryan become a political streamer? Mm. Nah. You know? Actually... McGee's America, like the ring of that? Do you like the ring of that? I could work that in. There's a title. Okay, okay. Uh, hang up an American flag over here, over yonder, behind me. Okay, we're coming together. We're building up a little. The McGee Report. Oh, okay, there's another one, the McGee Report. I just don't want to get intermingled with, with the Daily Report. Oh, sorry, the Daily Wire. We're good. Or what was it, the... The Rubin Report with Dave with with Dave Rubin. Gotta love Dave Rubin. What a guy. What an honest and decent man. Lying with Ryan. <laughs> That's a good one. Alexandra, thank you for the $5 tip. And as well, we got Kat coming in with five gifted subs. Thank you both for continuing to support the stream and just showing up and watching. Uh, seeing y'all in chat. And then and then seeing y'all uh, on my bank statements. I don't actually... Y'all's y'all names don't show up as you're using... You know, the, the general idea, you understand what the general idea was. The Orion Factor. Oh... Oh, 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 McGee Wars. These, these are all great. These are all beautiful. Oh, no. Cool. 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 Uh, Nashi 98. Fuck me. Damn it. You gifted a sub, though. Hero of the Moon. Resubscribed. Eight months. Thank you. Thank you very much for supporting this stream. We will be gaming soon. I don't know. I, maybe it would be nice to do Truck Sim. Let's see what... It, well, I, on Steam right now, I have American Truck Simulator, Cuphead. I'm kind of fine. Fallout 3. I could do a, a playthrough of Fallout 3. That might be fun. Halo Infinite. Not really interested in streaming that. Master Chief Collection... Would be interested in streaming Halo 3 campaign or Halo ODST campaign. Phasmophobia. Want to play with friends. I think soloing it changes the game, but... I don't know. I like the social aspect. Sea of Thieves, always. And Sekiro, we already said that we wanted to do the gauntlets, so... No, I'm not interested in playing Happy Wheels. Sekiro in anticipation for Elden Ring? Hey. Maybe. I would love a Fallout playthrough. I play through that once a year. I do like Fallout 3, and it's the, the Game of the Year edition. I can't remember if I needed to do some, like, Sometimes, if a game's old, you have to download some, like, patches that users have made to help out the game. You have to, like, go into the source file. I can't remember if this is one of those instances. I've never made it all the way through New Vegas. Let me see. How many hours do I have in, in New Vegas on Steam. Because I played New Vegas originally on my Xbox. See, uh, just on Steam, I have 33.5 hours. 
I never fucking beat it. Ah, oh, I know. I'm an asshole. Unofficial patch for Fallout 3. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I think it might have been New Vegas that gave me trouble, and 3's kind of fine. Oh, I loved the destroy. Oh, guess what? Also, I got... I don't know, it's not called Platinum, but I got all the achievements for Destroy All Humans uh, during quarantine. So, okay, 40 out of 40. Can I get some applause? It's not hard. It was pretty fun. I can't wait for the second one to come out. I don't think there's a, like, a specific date on it, unfortunately. Fuck Among Us. It can be fun. I just haven't played it in a bit. Back for Blood. <clears throat> I'm just looking at now the games that I just don't. Let's see. I'd love to play Far Cry Primal, honestly. That would be so fun for stream. <laughs> I have 60 hours in it. Uh, I would really... It's <clears throat> so... Fun. It's ridiculous. You just club people in the head. And that's really it. Primal's so fun. And I think it would be just fun to stream too. Primal these nut... Yeah, I okay. Okay, bugs. Nobody basically resubscribed. Hey, now you're somebody who subscribed for two months. Thank you for supporting the channel. Thank you for being here. I, I like doing this every once in a while. But right after, I thank... The Ocean Cat... For resubscribing. 19 months. I haven't even been streaming a consecutive or a grand total of 19 months. So, Jesus, thank you. Please play The Forest. I don't know if I'm interested in The Forest. I looked it up and I looked up some gameplay. I don't know if it's my type of game, unfortunately. You really have committed with that 19 months. Thank you again. And nobody basically, again, thank you for the two months. Thank you for showing back up and continuing to support. Look at him desperately trying to move on. <laughs> what, what, have, what, have, what was I trying to move on from? Did I lose my train of thought? Help me get it back. Wake up. No, I'm reading chat, okay? I have some brain cells left. Fucking assholes in chat. Fine. We're gonna play fucking... I'm gonna play something to punish chat. It's the worst game here. I mean, I don't buy bad games, so... Kind of hard, honestly. I played Bully way back when. Why don't you want me to play Bully? Oh, oh. I, I get it. Yeah, there's nothing here that would be a pain in the ass, really. Did the long dark get better? It was good, and it was fun at first. I wonder, like, what updates they've brought to it. I haven't played it since it was, like, in its first stages. Like, I haven't, I don't think I've ever played the official release.
read the Bible on stream. That's a good idea. Read the whole Bible subathon. Thigh high senpai subscribed with their Twitch Prime. Thank you. Thank you for coming along. Games with chat could be interesting. That would be... F Honestly, I had this idea the other day. No one's ever thought of it. I'm kidding. But it was just... A, I thought I thought for this channel, I go into Phasmophobia, and then I just put the room code, and I actually have to work and play with some of y'all. But then I was like, mm. I don't know who... Nobody, nobody who is in here right now is probably a part of it. But there was this mo there was this time where I played Halo Three with a bunch of people from chat uh, on stream. It was really fun. Ah, I don't want to play fucking solo Phasmo. No, no way. Thank you, Ebar Plays, for resubscribing. That's two months. That's continuous support right there. Thank you very much. Just watched the episode of Bubba Fett. <laughs> and this dude's still talking. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> Welcome, why not? <laughs> You're a prime gaming member. Play Halo Infinite? Ah, uh, nah. I'm good. Sea of Thieves solo galleon. Yeah, let's fucking go. Let's just switch to Sea of Thieves right now and solo a galleon. Pick the first fight we can. Do it then. No. Well, I, I don't want to commit because it's already almost midnight for me. I'm getting old. You should find super cheap. That's a good idea. I should just have a fishing stream where it's nothing but different. Because I, I don't know... I could probably spend sometimes only an hour with one or maybe not even that because it's so bad, but I would like to do like a just a fishing stream in general. Ryan, I just got here. Well, welcome, Jam. You know what? What are you doing with this music right now? Be calm again. Be still my beating heart. There's nothing. Oh. I'm so tempted just to put some Minecraft music on. Do you play specifically fishing games or games that have fishing added in? Uh, I just like when there's ever a fishing mechanic. I don't, like a game doesn't have to have fishing for me to enjoy it. He goes ice fishing when? Uh, pro probably never. Although, good content right there. Are you going to play some? Hey, Loaf. What the fuck? 
Chill out. Relax. Calm down. Take uh, Wipe off the drool with your bib. Okay? No, no gaming tonight. More than likely. Unless there's like... No, I doubt there will be any gaming. This is just a very boring... Spend time with chat and talk stream because I'm bad at reading chat while playing games and so this is kind of like a every once in a while you know what if we just focused on chat and chilling and relaxing although if just chatting is a category I'm, are there just a lot of people that just talk to their see I don't check this shit see my thought is like they're all like doing something they all have like a some sort of gimmick right Let's not. See, they're all doing something. They're like all the internet. They're like cooking. I, I like don't see anyone. Okay, there's a few people. What are you working on? Okay. I just saw my face. And I hated that. Yeah. I guess there are some people just 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 chatting with their chat. So I guess I don't I don't feel so bad. Ryan, I watched someone do a 72 hour stream from their couch. Literally sat on their couch. Okay. This is awesome, but I'm barely clinging to consciousness. Old underscore Stella. You should get some sleep then. Thank you for supporting, but do not stay up because the VODs are there. And uh, I don't typically want to stream this late. I mean, going into this late maybe, but I want to start a bit earlier. We'll start gaming again. me reading chat in silence wonderful how are you feeling after covid are all your symptoms yeah, yeah, yeah i don't i don't i don't have any lasting symptoms i feel i just uh i was very achy and i felt really bad i felt sick you know stuff nose running a fever just didn't want to get up. Just had to take a lot of naps throughout the day. But like I don't now I'm fine. Like I I never lost my sense of smell or taste or anything like that. Oh shit. Hold up. Hold up. This is the music squires listen to after hooking up with a fair maiden. You couldn't be more right, Justin, but lag. Welcome, my friend. This is, uh, you know, one of those streams where all I do is talk uh, at chat. And I push my agenda forward. Agendas. Hey. I'm Sin... I don't know what that is. Is that a name? A <laughs> hundred bits. Thank you. Would you ever considering doing a chill art stream, perhaps? Just like request. I thought of that, but I'm no artist, so I don't think that that would really go over too well. second
Like that? Come on. You know, you know you like that. Thank you for mispronouncing my name. Tell me how to pronounce it. I'm looking for your color right now. Tell me how to pronounce it phonetically or the best way you can. Why not? Let's see if I remember it too. I remember your color. Looking for it. I am so focused. <laughs> Ryan McGeezy's color confirmed. Yep. I'm Sen. No one. Everyone just calls me Sen, though, because they small brain. Hey, I'm so, hey Sen. There we go. So didn't I? Okay, so Senoy. No, wait, hold up. I, I I definitely fucked that up. I'm Sen Noy. I'm Sen Noy. Do you not want to have? Do you want to separate the? Uh, I'm I'm going I'm going too deep. Lego, chill. Yeah, that's correct. Okay. There we go. Sonoy. Turn up, thank you for subscribing. As well as sucked my spaghetti for subscribing. Both of you using Twitch Prime, by the way. He just says, no, no. I didn't hiss at my dog. It's not a hiss. <laughs> it's the my dog. <laughs> Creeper hiss. My cat says hi. Well, hello. To your cat, who's all, who's probably so transfixed right now, going, damn, this guy's entertaining. What? He decorated for the stream? He shouldn't have. Good night, Ryan. I'm not sleeping until you say it back. Okay. Good night. There you go. You highlighted your message. You got your point across fairly well. And thank you for coming. And shit. I bark at my cats. <laughs> you know, like barking orders. <laughs> Holy shit. Dank doggo. Thank you for gifting those subs. That's very generous of you. 100%? Where are we at? Hype? What what hype level are we at? Come on. Level 1 complete? Woo! Dank! Wow! We are really streaming here. Level 3 hype? No, wait. No, we're level 3? Oh, man. We got 4 minutes. And we're losing that hype. Guys, money? Uh, and also no bromo resubscribe two months it means you're sticking with it. I appreciate it. Um, trying to decide if I'd rather have Matt or Ryan take me from, listen, no bromo. Let's, let's not. Let's not get a little, let's not get too, you know, let's not make it weird. Let's not, let's, let's not make this, a, you know, 
Wait, level four hype? But again, no promo. Come on. Come on. Get yourself together. You got to pull yourself up by your bootstraps and just kind of march through life and gotta kind of get rid of that side of you. You gotta get a job, make a good wage and all that. Okay. Come on. You can do better. Uh can you believe we're almost at level five hype? Cause uh also, hey a Alexandra, how how's it switching between two accounts? Thank you for the bits. Boss baby anonymous. Thank you for the tip. <laughs> Damn. We made it to level four, ladies and gentlemen. Can you believe it? This that's a true dub. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for the bits. Thank you for the Y'all actually do y'all actually hype right now. That's crazy. <laughs> Thank you, uh Invader Zeno, who subscribed with Twitch Prime and thank you for the bits, I'm Sonoy. You say Sen, so are you just just Sonoy? Is is just Sonoy fine? Or if you want your whole username, that's cool. No judge. And thank you, Peachy T and Dank Doggo for the bits. My man deserving all the hype. Sixty nine percent hype. Come on, funny, funny. Ninety one percent. With Ermy underscore Snur what? Erm Ermy. Well, Ermy, you subscribed with Twitch Prime. Dude. Thank Doggo, thank you. Trashy Magoo, thank you for the bits. Hey Boba, thank you for the bits. Aru Aruka, do thank you for the bits. Thank you, trash for the bits. Uh, uh, mo mono sodium underscore glutamate. Uh, you uh. You gifted 20 subs. You realize this, right? It wasn't two. Jesus Christ. We don't... Hold up. Thank you so much. And you just subscribed yourself as well. Holy fucking shit. Thank you everyone who just recently... 375% level hype from all that shit. Boss Baby Anonymous. Thank you again. Boss Baby is always watching. Thank you. I always pronounce your name Scussy Endis. So... Thank you for the bits. Mono. That is ridiculous. Again, where the fuck are you in chat? I know you gotta be mouthing off somewhere. Unless you're sticking to the shadows. I've collected level 5 emotes. We got so many... I got so many emotes. That's crazy, yo. What color are you in chat? 
I have no idea. I don't. I don't. I don't know what my eyes are looking for. They're looking for M, but I can't find you. Unless again, you're just chilling, relaxing, s staying elusive. Thank you, Goblin. That's very nice. Thank you. <laughs> Ryan's eyes only look for a specific color. I'm looking for the letter M right now. Big M. I'm looking for mono. That's the word I'm looking for. Thank you for being overly generous and supportive of the stream. M. <laughs> oh, where are you, chat? What color are you? Mono. <sighs> he wants to chill. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Chat wants to update me that I missed something. Then please do so. But. Thank you for being so fucking supportive. Boss Baby Anonymous with another five, with well, another tip is five dollars. Watch the Boss Baby. No, <laughs> I'm not. But thank you. It's very nice. Fuck Boss Baby. <laughs> That's just like you've you've chosen war. Thumish. Subscribe. Thank you. They aren't here, dude. <sighs> did they... Did I accidentally miss being able to thank them? Mysterious. How do you feel about Megamind? Didn't like it, first watch. Loved it, second watch. I like, didn't hate it. I just wasn't, I was like, hmm. Ryan, what did you say about Boss Baby? He's coming, he probably heard you. Hide before it's too late. Boss Baby calls me at 4 a.m. Angry as hell, all hell. <laughs> no bitches. That's a good meme. It's funny. Hello, it's me again, and I've changed my name. Jimmy. Okay, just Jimmy. <laughs> okay. You're like, just fucking call me Jimmy. No more, no more Jim shits or Jay shits. Just Jimmy now. Well, welcome back, Jimmy. I'm sorry that I forced you to change your name due to always calling you shits. That's my bad. Do you like El Dorado? Not my favorite movie, not my favorite animated film. Don't really have too much nostalgia with it. I probably watched it like two times uh, when I was younger. Never really clicked with me. I think if I go back now, I'll definitely appreciate it. But it just didn't click with me when I was younger. And I didn't, and I have never gone back to it uh, since. I'm going to be honest. All right. Braden, thank you for the $5 tip.
Thank you for continuing to support us. And I'm happy to hear that our content makes you feel epic. I appreciate it. Thank you very much for the kind compliments. Boss Baby Riddler has tipped $3. <laughs> Riddle me this, jokester. What do you get when you cross a boss baby with a society that threats him like dirt? Or treats him like dirt, sorry. <clears throat> I don't know, boss baby Riddler. Someone really fucking is going all out with the boss baby shit. Thank you. <laughs> what is this? What is going on? What happened? Something happened. Something is... Something bad is happening. A bunch of bullshit follows just happened. What does that mean? Like, they're all bullshit. Baby Riddler. I don't want fucking bots. That's a lot. That just clogs up the feed. Go sub only quick. <laughs> what is this? Does this happen often in streams? Okay, thank you for subscribing. It does. Do these accounts get deleted after some time? Or is it just... There's just a bunch of, like... Empty fucking accounts that just continue to... Just kind of clog the feed or whatever. Boss Baby's rat. <laughs> yeah, do you see all, like, the goofy names here? And it's just gonna go on forever now. They do get deleted by Twitch. Okay, good, 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 good. <clears throat> Why does this even happen, though? Uh, I'm sure someone could set something up to where, like, they put in a command and it mass through all the accounts that they have connected to this, whatever. I, I don't know how it works. I'm not a, I'm not a, I'm not a whatever the fuck. Let's see. I think that reset my alerts. I think my alerts have been reset now. Go ahead, someone give me money and test it. That's gotta be against TOS. Begging for money, right? I mean, it's the point of Twitch, right? Peachy T has used 100 bits. Thank you. Bits usually appear, don't they? <laughs> you ain't getting shit with all these. How I, I have like an ad every 30 minutes, like one ad. I think that's what I have it set for. If not, oops. I'll look into it. Wait, there are four ads? I thought there was like options and it was like an ad every 30 minutes or some shit. Can it stack? It was four to five of them? What the fuck? Hold up. Thank you for subscribing, Sonoy. 
It works. Um... Where would this... What am I fucking looking for? Boss Baby. Please apologize on behalf of the McGee Foundation to Boss Baby for fuck Boss Baby. <laughs> Clueless, thank you for gifting a sub. Thank you very much. As well as... Nauseous? Nausicaa? Nausicaa? Nas... Na... Nausicaa? Nausicaa? You subscribe using Twitch Prime? Anyways, I was looking at... Is it under streaming tools? No, content. I'm bad at this. Hold up. Streaming tools? No. Um, <clears throat> Filthy Beans, thank you for gifting a sub. To Sasha Gray? Wow, Sasha. I'm so glad that uh, your, your buddy Filthy Beans gifted you a sub. Nausicaas. 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 Okay. Uh, where the fuck is the ad shit? Hold up. I'm so... <laughs> Be patient, he's only just learned how to read. Fuck off! I forgot where to go for the... I looked at it at one point, now I don't know where to go for it. Thank you for the $2 tip, minion movie. I would snap that boss baby bloke in half, bro. Damn, minion movie. Minion movie's going off. Minion movie versus boss baby. OK Rush has converted from a prime gaming sub to a tier one sub. Damn. Respect. Joseph, thank you for subscribing. Yeah, uh, hold up. Okay, 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 okay. This 30 second ad break equals 10 minute pre roll ad free. Wait, wait, what? How do I? I need to change you. Best I can do is point six minutes an hour. But like before it was just at I think it was only at like where was it? It's probably at like three, 
two or three minutes an hour. I could take it down. What's the usual? Do y'all know? I don't know. Y'all talking about ads. Y'all having to watch like three to fucking four ads uh, while watching the stream. And I, only, and I thought I only had it set up to be like a 30 second ad every 30 minutes or so. But I can't really change the spacing of the first one that pops up. It always has to pop up within the first bit of the stream. Like I can't move that around it. Or wait, start delay. Oh, I can. Okay, there it is. Every 30 minutes. Okay, there we go. I got that. And then... Boom. And then, like, length... 30 seconds or a minute. Oh, 30 seconds. There we go. Save changes. Okay, I fixed it. Sorry. I The whole thing is was, I guess, confusing to me at first. I thought I had it set a certain way, but I didn't. And that's my bad. I think it should be fixed now. How do you know when the ads come up? Does it tell you? Do I get a little notification somewhere? Sub if you don't want ads. Hey, that's another solution. Look at Ryan pretending he didn't know. I, I honestly, I really am very boomer-esque with this shit. Ask anyone who wants uh, me to, who has to communicate with me through Discord. Twenty ads in Rapid Succession. Oh my bad. Oops. He. <laughs> Oops and doodle. Well, I changed it now, and it looks correct. We have 30 seconds. It says length, 30 seconds. So we're doing... My ad density is at the minimum, which is a minute an hour. And it's spaced. Spacing is 30 minutes. And the first ad doesn't even start until the first 30 minutes. Y'all don't even have to enter. Y'all can enter and just chill, and then 30 minutes comes up if y'all stay long enough, which most people probably don't. Done. Because y'all been generous, and I, I'm still going to run ads. <laughs> but I mean, I did not know it was how four to five or whatever, however the fuck many y'all said it was. That was not intentional. Oopsies. Weird for me, it's an ad every two seconds. <laughs> I've been getting four, but Lamau's six ads would have been hilarious to sit through. I got six ads several times. Not anymore. You're good now. Apologies. Someone's got... Yeah, it ain't gonna be me. You know, I think I'm up to like 10 bikes now. But real talk. Real talk. Um... I fucking I gotta fucking get my hair did. I had did go out recently. It's been a while since I've gone out on my uh, cruiser, and I took a nice ride with Tucker around the uh, like Rose Bowl area. Super nice ride. Super chill. It was I, I was glad to get back at it. Someone almost 
fucking rear-ended me on the way home. I'm going, I'm like on the, I can't remember which fucking highway. I was on a busy interstate on Saturday. Uh, this was probably around six or something. I'm, I'm heading home and I'm riding my bike, my motorbike, you know, making all sorts of, you know, yelling, flicking people off, throwing beer cans at them, going scared, like waking up. Like if I see a sleeping kid, just, you know, hear them cry. I go, (laughs) you know, off in the, into the wind, the usual biker shit. And so as I'm doing that, um, I see that traffic is coming to a sill, so I'm going to stop. I'm not fully comfortable in weaving through traffic. I really only, I don't weave. I only, um, I forget what, uh, brain fart. Uh, but I will go in between cars if it's like standstill or near standstill because it's just easier to get through traffic. And it's legal in California. Lane splitting, yes. Um, so here I am. Getting on my brakes. All of a sudden, I hear skirt from behind me. I'm just like, so I look in my rear view. I don't see anything. And the minute I'm looking in my rear view, I see something right to the side of me in my just actual, just peripheral vision. And it's this car. And she goes, and he stops. And I'm like, this, this motherfucker almost did something to me. He obviously swerved out of the way because, look, again, I will give him the benefit of the doubt, right? A bike, it's hard to tell as a bike when the sun's kind of going down and everyone, all the cars, headlights are on the road. Um, if you're not paying attention, I can see how the tail light of a bike, which it's only like one thing, right? Uh, can blend with cars. So I get that. No, no benefit of the doubt, only malice and ill intent. Also on the same drive home, uh, I'm riding on the highway and this guy just almost hits me changes lanes i have to like put on the brake and kind of like move over and slow down so you can get in front of me and i'm passing him and i look because you always you're always interested what the fuck is this person doing he's just no blinker remember no blinker when he's almost hitting me running me off the road just probably texting his mistress or some bullshit People are crazy. Oh, I I don't know if anyone rides, but the only thing I will say is gear is important. And uh, see a yellow light and you're on a bike, best you just stop. If another car tries to make that yellow or a left turn from that yellow, you ain't winning. So, now just wear a t-shirt and shorts. A lot of people do, and that's their choice, right? It's not affecting me. It's not affecting anyone else's safety but their own. They're making their own decisions. They're an adult. It's not advised. Good night, turnip. He just tweeting about. (laughs) Imagine slaying Ryan in an act of foolishness while texting the mistress in an automobile. Such absurdity. It w- that that does sound pretty absurd. Good night, Ryan, bitch ass. That thanks, Trevor. Thank you. Thank you for. Uh, you're probably already gone, but thank you for stopping by. You should uh, come visit soon, again. D- 
Dank Doggo. Thank you for the 400 bits. Look forward to it, Trevor. Wink. Okay, we got ramen last time, Trevor. You need to pick another meal that we need to... You need to pick another dinner date. Whatever Trevor wants, Trevor can have. Ooh, yes. Let's get some KBBQ. If you have a place uh, that you really like and want to go to, I'm all down for. Uh, there is a place uh, that I know of that I uh, really like. That's like, kind of like the go-to for whenever someone's visiting for me. Ryan, how do I ask this girl out? Um, hmm. Several options. Uh, you could not. Uh, you could also write a letter do you like me yes or no or you could go hey hey baby hey hey thick legs I want in on this and then if she says no let's go to okay sweet 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 next time you're in town it's KBBQ baby <laughs> legs <laughs> if a man called me thick legs <laughs> it's like one of the most quote unquote triggering things right <laughs> That's just bullying at that point. <laughs> See, thick legs could be misconstrued as like, oh, but, you know, I'm, I meant, th you know, hey, th thick bitch. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> thick leg shoddy. <laughs> thick bitch. <laughs> Hey, thick legs. <laughs> so fucking disrespectful. <laughs> Ugh, I'd hate to watch someone like me chat. I don't know how y'all do it. The streamers that I usually watch are like, most of the time, like super wholesome people. Like, we got Fuzzy Bond. They're mostly Sea of Thieves, be like Fuzzy Bond. Um, procedural, uh, <laughs> but it would, it would get a rise out of me to hear Fuzzy say something completely vulgar and out of left field. I don't think it's in, I, I don't think that's, that's, that's in him. He's a wonderful man. A low, overweight woman. <laughs> what if he actually went with this idea? Hey, thick legs. Why don't, why don't we go do something? Like, have sex. And then you flick your cigarette in her face. And then by the time, you know, she's like, Ah, oh, what the fuck? She looks up. You already gotta be quick with it. You're... Because you don't want her to see you doing this. You want it to be like, she's looking down, right? She, you go, flick, she's looking down, and then she just looks up, and you're just already flicking her off. And you're like, yep. She'll respect you then. That's how my mom and stepdad met. Beautiful thing. Beautiful thing. Will this be able to light anymore? We will find out.
Now, chat, can we get, can we, can we do, can we, can we just do a little test? Cause I just want to see, I want to see how much I can trust y'all. We're goofy right now. We're having fun. We're having a good time. We're all smiling and giggling, right? But if I were to send you over in a raid, I'm not saying it's right now. I'm just saying when eventually the stream ends and we raid someone and it, and it's not someone that we're particularly used to or we go to often. You could understand why continuing these bits would not be okay. Right? Right? You would understand that. Yeah, for sure. Yes. Sir. Okay. Thank you. I just wanted to make sure. Because I know chat gets... As I said, a little goofy, some gags, some giggles, and some good times. So I'm just making sure that we all understand that there needs to be some sort of etiquette, you know, when we go to someone else's stream. They have a chat that's all of their own, and we don't ever want to um, be suffocating. Because uh, one, it's like not a good impression on... Like, I'll be honest, like, it's not a good impression on me, even though, you know, no one should judge the streamer for whatever nonsense sometimes chat can get into. But it, I, it, most, mostly though, it's, I don't, I just don't want to fucking ruin someone's vibe. Raids are fun because everyone's like, raid, 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 whatever. But after that, you know, calm down a bit and maybe just try to get into what they're doing. And no mention of me, no mention of past, you know, past inside jokes from the last stream and all that. Try to focus on what that streamer is doing and uh, try to vibe with them. And if you feel like you can't, there are other streams out there uh, that you can watch if you don't like the one that we uh, choose to raid. I just wanted to make sure we have this conversation, right? I, I don't endorse... Uh, uh, immature foolishness uh, that can that is that is seen as annoying and negative and detrimental to another person's streaming environment. Okay. What happens in what happens in chat stays in chat. Exactly. Exactly. Boss Baby Anonymous. Thank you for the tip again. Little Man McGee. I'm glad to be a little man. In the world of Boss Baby. Yeah, you just different humor at all. Most of us switch the vibe depending on the stream. And I've noticed that. And I and I gotta say. This is not to, like, this is, I'm not talking to, like, everyone. I'm just making sure that the more people know, the more, the more people can, like, maybe keep others in check and help the other streamers out, you know? Because I know most of y'all, I do go over to kind of view the raid sometimes, and it's like, y'all are super chill, and y'all jump right into whatever, like, my buddy Kronos, who we've raided many times. You know, you go right in, and it's not like, oh, Ryan did it. Y'all start talking about whatever uh, he's doing and ask him questions, and that's great. I think, you know, you shouldn't bring one personality into the chat of another unless the conversation organically works itself in that way, right? Peachy T's exactly, exactly, on the money. <clears throat> Sonoy, I'm glad we got this name figured out. Cause look, I haven't. I don't think. I, no, I'm. I'm I want to reiterate. I'm saying it right. There's no like send no like send noy. It's Sonoy, all fluid. Just making sure. I want to make sure. <laughs> you know. I'm not disrespecting you. 
Marco, thank you for subscribing with Twitch Prime. Very appreciated. And Log, Loggy Music, you subscribed earlier. Thank you for that. First time chat. Ooh, okay, Marco. Thank you. Ryan, you mispronounced my name. Fart girl 21. Doubt it. <laughs> yep, it's correct. Don't worry. Okay, good, 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 good. Ryan calls me mayonnaise sometimes. I guess it's fine. <laughs> Thank you, mayonnaise. <laughs> yeah. Chad, I think this one's... Yeah. Oh, that's gone. Done and over with. And I've been talking for three hours. Wow. With chat, which is ridiculous. But cool. Try and pronounce my name. Okay. Sans Vertigo. Right? Some Undertale thing? Huh? Ryan, are the rumors true? Do you... Uh... Which strain is that? Uh, I don't know. I don't know where... Where the fucking bag is. It was right here. I swear to God. We have another one, but it's like, do we really need to? I probably shouldn't. Don't want to dehydrate myself too much before going off to bed, right? No, I'm not now. I'm not pronouncing everyone's name now. I'm not going to try to pronounce everyone's. I have to try to pronounce enough names as it is. Ryan, put your hair in braid sounds. Hey, fun fact. I learned how to do the whatever fucking... I can't remember the name of the braid. The simple one. French? Maybe not. Maybe that's the complex one. The easy one where it's just like you get three strands and you just thread them through. You know, all that shit. Whatever. Because I liked doing it to the to my to my first girlfriend uh, in youth group, she taught me, and I just had fun with it. Snurm, <laughs> I can't believe you could say snurm, Ermy snurm. <laughs> yeah, well. Ryan, why do I have... You don't... There's no way you have five ads. I have it saved. Spacing 30 seconds. Uh, it says, your ad density, one minute an hour. You're trolling me, and I don't appreciate it. Delay is 30 minutes, by the way, in ads as well. I am wondering, I learned to roll joints with tobacco and weed. Uh, aren't there like spliffs? That's what they're called. That's what we called them. Daniel and I would. Oh, back in South Carolina, man. Uh, Daniel and I, I don't know who 
most most of y'all know about know Daniel Kyer, uh, one of my good friends from the good old days. Uh, we would always we we would go on drives. I know, not good, not good. But we'd go on drives and we would empty out cigarettes and then grind up weed and then like do like half and half, twist it up at the top and like put a few in the pack. And so like it would just look like we're smoking uh, cigarettes, but the smell is way we we'd never no. There's no way you could get away with that. The smell is not a cigarette. Smells like a, a, a wacky cigarette there, boy. But we would just do that like if we were going around driving, if we were going heading to Beezers. Um, yeah. Goofy cigarettes. Oh yeah, just that. That's 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 a lot of what we did. It was uh, like late at night. We just we'd both be bored and we'd just go drive around. And usually, we would end up at one of two places at some point during the night. Okay, we would definitely either hit up CVS or Kroger for snacks for when we got back to my place. I was usually on the drive back, but at some point, because these two places stayed open late, we would either go to Beezer's, which is a sandwich shop downtown, Columbia, or we would go to uh, Car uh, Ale House in Harbison, I think it was. Um, there was another Carolina Wild Wings. I don't think it was St. Andrew's Road, but it was off near that area, but that was more with Gray. But with Daniel, we'd go to Ale House because it was just get teriyaki wings and then one of the one time one of the cooks was like you gotta have them grilled and then flash fried we're like what's that it's like oh it's when you grill them then you put them in the fryer but only real quick and you take them right back out we're like okay so we just always asked for that and then it would continue to confuse people and so now we just we just ended up never uh as as time went on really like, okay obviously that was just a hit his thing that he did <coughs> But yeah, those would be the two places we'd visit. And then go back to my place and play like Black Ops 2 Zombies. Or see, Gray and I would do Horde Mode. Daniel was mostly zombies. Daniel got so fucking pissed. Y'all ever get a friend that gets a little too mad? Uh, when competitive in games, you know, we all have that, that one friend. <laughs> yes. Here's the thing. I will sometimes get really fucking tilted. I'll sometimes get really fucking upset. But there are people who change the whole mood of the room. They get upset, you know? Yeah, it's me, sadly. <laughs> oh no, you're toxic. We, our favorite thing to do is, I think, play town. And then we really tried to figure out the bus route shit for transit or whatever. Favorite thing about life right now. Hmm. Days where it's just kind of calm and it's me and Lego. That's that. I would say that. Those moments where it's like, ah, I'm just relaxed. I'm not stressed or anxious or whatever. I'm just, I'm just, ah. I'm monotone through the whole day. You know, you're just like, hmm acceptable all 
I mean, do you take dabs or do you only smoke? Uh, I I had a dab rig and I didn't take care of it, and so I need to. I I enjoyed it. I just think I like. I think my favorite way to smoke used to be bongs, and then I liked uh, blunts or joints. I think it's also this the 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 habit of being a smoker. That's what you were picked up from being a smoker is the oral fixation. You know, you know what I'm saying? Time passes so quick. Every yeah, the time's going by. It honestly doesn't feel like I've I've almost been out here now. Holy shit! Seven years. No, I have been out here over seven years now. Shit. Yep. And I'm here. I don't... Nobody here. But this is this is back before... Like, everything. I used to stream back in South Carolina. I streamed myself playing Five Nights at Freddy's and beating it. And I streamed Five Nights at Freddy's 2 and beat it. And I streamed myself playing Slender Man. This was back in probably 2014, 2013, anywhere around there. I also, in 2014, uploaded a bunch of mini-movie reviews that are now gone, reduced to ashes, atoms. And then I, I, I did stream when I uh, lived with uh, Mark, Daniel, and Matt in the, what a, the content house that we had. Um, I streamed the, what's the game where it's a choose your own adventure and it's snowing and it's something Windigo is the main threat. <coughs> Reduced to Kratom. <laughs> Until dawn, yep. I was streaming until dawn, and Matt came in. Came in. <laughs> Matt came in uh, and just sat with me for a little bit of the stream, and I think that was there's there's probably no footage of that anywhere because no one really cared about us at that time, right? Um, so that was like that was technically the first let's play Matt and I ever did together was when he stepped in and just bantered with me while him and I were playing Until Dawn. I remember that. That was, that was, that was, that was those were good times. Humble beginning. Yeah, you know how it is. Ryan, did anyone ever get irritated about being monotone? My mom and family used to think I didn't care about anything, but it's just how I talk. Uh, you know, I feel like, like right now, I'm changing the like all, but generally, like I mean, y'all wouldn't describe me as monotone, I would imagine, because like there's a lot of moments in the podcast, right, with the laugh, and you know, I do have more of an animated way. Of, of you know when you're talking and you want to have sell more of the comedy in the voice because it's funnier if you can like try to picture it and try to go with the bits and stuff but <clears throat> I, I I don't know if I have more of the monotone voice I feel like I have more of the monotone like I'm upset like I think people always generally think that I'm upset or that I'm mad or something's wrong. Matt just knows that's my face now. He's learned. Brent never learned. During like work meetings at Game Grumps, he'd be like, "What's going on?" You're like, "What?" He's like, "You're just looking at me." Like I'm like, "I'm just I'm I'm we're in the meeting. I'm looking at you. I I don't have any way of uh, doing anything. I, I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing." <clears throat> but I guess you know he is just looking at me, and I'm just. So I don't know if that gives off a vibe. 
I might have resting bitch face. That's just my face when I'm just like not emoting. Like right now, like I'm not like, like this is me like trying to look more like pissed off, like I guess, but like no emoting, just chill, relaxed. <laughs> Don't do that again. It's literally just me. Whatever. That is, see, right? But, like, I've had many people just be like, you just look like you're upset. Or you look mad. Are you okay? Like, I get, I got, I got that a lot. I mean, granted, there were some days I probably was upset or not in a good mood. Yeah, I feel it just sucked having people thought I was happy when I, or wasn't happy when I was. For me, I, I guess I didn't really take it farther than just like, oh, I guess I just have resting bitch face to some extent. Um, so. Everyone wants you to be like nice emojis. <coughs> you just didn't blink at all? I mean, I don't know how often you need to blink. Right? How often How often do y'all blink? Every 10 seconds, I need the moist in my eyes. What am I even doing? What am I talking about? Like, this is probably one of the weird... Like, anyone watching this stream? Because I don't have tr chat on the side. I mean, they could watch chat on the VOD because it does keep a record to some extent, but it's like, what am I doing? What am I? I'm just, yeah. What do you think about that? Oh uh, yeah. No, but I do think that this thing is, yeah, that that's pretty cool. Sorry. It's one of those moments where I just took a step outside of myself and was like, what the fuck am I doing? Just, uh, talking in my, in my empty, in my empty den, my closet. Talking about blinking. <laughs> you just be vibing. <laughs> this is it. Live in the moment. Yeah, that's me. Right here. How do you like the music? I haven't heard any complaints, but for me, I couldn't imagine how sometimes it's blaring and like it does not fit the tone of the conversation at all sometimes, but hey, we're here for it. Dude, your hairline is a hey, wig line, but thanks. Best stream ever. This one will go down in history, baby. You know what, chat? It is past one. Which means... I think it's about time... We wrap things up. You know? I think I've had a great time with y'all. I'm glad we could all pray together. And I hope some of y'all who are still down, because the person who I'm going to raid is very chill. Uh, we haven't raided them before. I'll give you a preemptive. Uh, they do Sea of Thieves. The vibes are usually pretty chill. Um, they play piano. Huh? Come on. Uh, they're really good at the game when it comes to PvP as well. But I find that their overall voice and tone of the stream is very relaxing. And I really enjoy it. So hopefully y'all will enjoy it too. Because I'm probably going to be watching in there as well. Because I do 
I do frequent this person's streams a lot. I do like their content. <coughs> if we unfortunately not Kronos this time. Another time soon. I want to play more with uh, Bean Boy, Kronos, and Jay. We did Phasmophobia last time. We played uh, Sea of Thieves before. We should do something again soon. This is someone we've never raided before, huh? And they're playing Sea of Thieves. Isn't that great? Stick around. You know, sh remember, let's be chill. But before we can do that, we have to... Ba-da-ba-ba, ba da ba ba da ba 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 da ba da ba da ba Uh, shit. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Relax, relax, relax. Hold up. Oh, it is it, it is going. Um, good, good, good. The credit the credits are fine. The credits are fine. We're good here. We're all good. Thanks for thank y'all for showing up. And I hope y'all I mean, come on in chat. Who's down to fall asleep to some to a nice voice? Like a nice kind of calm voice with some nice waves. Maybe you hear like a little, you're like, oh shit, some action's going on. Watch. He'll take care of it. All of a sudden, just hear like boots running on the deck. Ooh, that sounds nice, doesn't it? Remember, let's be respectful. Let's be chill. Let's match the vibes of their stream. Remember, we are going into their stream. We are not bringing our stream to theirs, right? I mean, I mean, that's what a raid is. We're bringing it. What I mean is we're not bringing this over there, right? This vibe, whatever. We're bringing support and uh, a good time, hopefully, for, for both parties. Hold up. Man, these credits are something else, eh? Hold up. I think I might have made an oopsie. Damn. By the way, they're not streaming right now. That's my bad. So guess what? Now it's just a general surprise of who we're rating, and you're not going to find out. So thank you for coming. Stay tuned for the raid. I lied. Uh, the vibes that I set you up for aren't the vibes that you're going to be dealt. So, uh, goodbye, have fun, and deal with it. I feel bad because I didn't do the closing curtain bit. Here, let me do that real quick. See? Okay, now I feel good. Now we can go here, right? Everyone's happy. Thank you for the bits. Dank Doggo, by the way. And, uh... Good night, everyone. Okay, real quick, real quick, everyone. Um, can you answer if you would rather watch Sea of Thieves or Minecraft? I'm, I'm in between two people. And I'll send you one way. You just let me know. Minecraft, you know, up the pole. Hold up. Hold up. Okay, here we go. Uh, it's gonna be a minute. Let's we'll do a minute poll. You know, y'all, y'all, y'all will f d dish it out. They're neck and neck. You know, I haven't stayed this long after the credits before. This is kind of this kind of bonkers, isn't it, chat? Yeah, I got the poll. Y'all are voting. There's, uh, it's, it's really neck and neck. Minecraft and Sea. It could be either one. We're just waiting to figure out which one we're watching. 
the Minecraft would probably be chill and fun, and then Sea of Thieves might be somewhat chill, but the person does do a lot of PvP, so it would be a lot of, probably a good bit of action, I'd imagine. Just to see if that changes the vote. Oh shit, Minecraft took the lead. Oh, it's almost done. Minecraft looks like it's going to win. 63 to 58, 64 to 58, and... Minecraft wins. <laughs> Have fun. And thanks, everyone. Thank you for supporting the stream. Bye.